Stop, stop, stop. What happened? What happened there? Is that the lights come off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Should we um, pull the car up and headlight it? That's a good idea. And we'll just go, we'll just that song again. That's cool. It's like, we're in the dark, we're just waiting for it to come back on. Oh, shit, me. I thought the camera broke. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> I'm loving the song, though. Yeah, thanks. Good half, good half, good first half. Yeah, yeah, it was a great first half. Okay, you don't need to do that. Remember exactly where you were, and then just pick it up. Hey guys, welcome to On the Scene. We're at the Geelong Botanical Gardens, and I am joined by the kite, not the kite machine. Where's where's the machine? Where's Evan? He doesn't have an acoustic bass, so I think he kind of felt a bit left out. He got cut. He got cut. He got cut. Sorry? Can he dance? Can he dance? <laughs> Can he dance? We Inter didn't dance. Interpretive, we had a interpretive dance, he's, he's brilliant. He would have been here. Will, will people be seeing that this Saturday at the studio for the live DVD filming? To be honest, they probably will. Yeah? Yeah, he'll, he'll be dancing. Yeah. I can't that, imagine him not. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, let, let's be honest, that's why we're all here. Let's talk about that's that. What, what can people expect at this show? It's, the, it's a pretty big, not many Geelong bands film a live DVD. Show. Yeah, well, that's what we sort of thought uh, when we sort of came up with the idea of it. Like, we kind of figured at this point in our career, it's probably a more uh, suitable thing to kind of uh, film us playing live as opposed to recording in a, an album in a studio just because I don't know you're trying to get into festivals and all that sort of stuff yeah. so it helps to have people be able to see what you like live. Uh, we put a fair amount of money into it as far as like we bought like all the lights and stuff ourselves and like and my dad's doing the light show and so cool. it's, all, it's all a pretty uh, sort of Everyone that's doing different things, like the guy with the PA, he's kind of like one of our friends. So it's all a little bit of like a little family that we've built together to um, do it. But um, yeah, we've built these like light. What do you what do you call them? Some mad sort of abstract tree props to go at the back that the have back little there. globes on them and stuff. They flash yeah, like dimming <laughs> ambiance. Should have brought them here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 perfect at the moment. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not what will be here on we Saturday. Nice and, uh, yeah, but um, is it mostly new stuff, or are you going to throw in some old songs? Uh, it's basically just everything we've got at the moment. So there's, or we're playing about 13 songs or something. So there's there's a uh, fair few new ones, but all the ones off the EP and everything. So for yeah. everyone that's been listening to that and um, checking us out on Facebook and YouTube. All that sort of stuff will be there. So this is something Nicola will want me to ask. Yep. Will it be the extended paper planes? Ah, uh, it will. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We said, tend to always extend that one now. So um, yeah, you pretty much don't really get the shortened version unless you listen to the CD. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's only five dollars a ticket. Hold the tickets up. Yes. Yeah, they're it's only five dollars for a pre-sale ticket if you come to us. Yeah. But it's ten dollars on the door. Is it from Facebook? <laughs> the best way to get it. If you yeah, Facebook you messages. And uh, if you're in Geelong, we'll come do some deliveries if you want. <laughs> yeah. James, yeah. personal, personal, personal well. touch. Yeah. <laughs> Deliver to your door. <laughs> That's it. I don't know if I'd want you to come to my door. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, James Sidebottom. He's playing. James, James Sidebottom. Yeah. Um. Like. Like as obviously some people know, I play with Ev in James Sidebottom's band, so we kind of thought it's only sort of would that fit just the hell out of me. <laughs> yeah, so it's like half of one band, half not. But um, yeah, so James is going to do a solo set to support, so that's going to be going off as it always is. And then uh, yeah, so Doors at eight, he'll be on yeah shortly after that, and then we're on after him. I, <laughs> yeah. I guess that's yeah, pretty much how it goes. So. And of course, this is still available. That is what is this? What am I holding here? The, the, uh, it's our EP. That's our. The Crook and the Skank debut EP, six track EP. Um, August last year it came out? Something like that? I mean, that July. July. July, yeah. Yeah, I think. Yeah. July, August, close enough. August, July, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, that's still available uh, on uh, www.thekitemachine.com.au. And yeah. When will the next can EP come. be coming out? That's so open up we'll the we'll end. Hopefully, it's a full length album. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. So yeah, um, after this. Um, project with the live DVD we're planning on possibly next year recording a uh, debut album so th that'll be exciting when it comes around but for now <laughs> we just focus on the DVD. Will this track that you're about to play be on that album or EP do you think? It definitely will. This one's called Lunatics um, and it's sort of our newest song. Cool. It's almost like our new single but we haven't recorded it as a single. Is this so. like an exclusive? <laughs> yeah <laughs> basically it's the yeah, first time it's been yeah. on the YouTube. Uh, on, uh, Internet, I think at all. So. Yeah, it'll be on YouTube. There you go. Dot com everywhere. Right. Exclusively <laughs> part of this. Yeah, that's all good. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> I'm gonna wait out of all 
love it. Funny how, when you come to spotlight, it matters. Because you and I need to get a grip for the others. Firstly, you got a lot for the money. Say girls, when I scan the figures, when I get too high, when I pull the trigger, then I wonder why. When the floors are bubble and it's sinking, could it be too subtle? I told you that I don't need to push your body. I say I told you so. I don't need to push your body. I say I told you so.